This is the sacrum. We don't want to confuse the sacrum with the tailbone. The sacrum is not the tailbone. However, we do see the tailbone uh, properly called the coccyx below. But let's look at the sacrum. The sacrum is a fascinating bone because it's actually the remnant of many fused bones. The sacrum was actually five initial bones, and we can see the uh, remnants of the transverse processes, the spinous processes. There was actually uh, discs at one time, little spaces of cartilage here that have fused. But the aspects of the sacrum that you'll need to know will be the sacral promontory, and the sacral promontory is where the disc of the fifth lumbar vertebrae is going to ride on top of it. There's going to be these rough surfaces on the side, and this is where the sacroiliac joint is going to be, so the pelvis will actually be joining the sacrum here. And then there are three to five uh, coccygeal vertebrae, or coccyx, and that's going to vary from person to person. These are semi-movable joints. They, they are capable of moving a little bit, um, especially in the female during uh, childbirth.